my god! So hello everybody and welcome back to Jacobs and Sarah's Garage and today we want to show you guys how to make cloud dough. This is a homemade mixture that provides great hands-on learning experience for the children. So one huge recommendation is to supervise the young children when playing with such things because they tend to put everything in their mouth. Its consistency can be pottery like flour and also moldable like damson. So it's great for shaping, pressing, molding, sculpting into different shapes. And the best of all is that we only need these two things. Cornstarch and hair conditioner. Let's begin by pouring all of our ingredients together into a bowl. It will be very sticky, but the magic really is to work it out. If you really feel that it's not damp enough, you can add more hair conditioner. You will actually give it such a great scent. And then just continue to work on it. It will get to our desired mixture. So you will realize that we have accomplished our mission when everything that has been left behind in your fingers will incorporate itself to our cloud dough. So here's the texture that I was looking forward to get. I really believe the kids will enjoy it. Now here comes an optional step. It really is optional, really up to you if you want to give some color to your dot. You can use food coloring or like myself, I did my own coloring. There she is. She really enjoyed her cloud doll. She really loved the pink one. But you guys know it's really the color. Some other ideas for them to play is to add twigs or pebbles. So they use their imaginative play, making bridges, for example, or sand castles. Ta -da! I really did enjoy making this project for her because of the learning opportunities that it comes with such as creativity, fine motor development, concentration, hand-eye coordination and control as well as language development because they will be saying the names of the shapes and let's not forget the imaginative play As per storage, I do really recommend to wrap it on plastic wrap or keep it on Ziploc bags when kids are done playing with the cloud doll. I do really hope you guys enjoyed this project as much as I did and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and see you next time. Bye bye! <laughs>